What's good, YouTube? It's Adam from I'm a Music Mogul, and welcome to another remake video. Today, we'll be remaking Offset's track featuring Cardi B Clout. They did release the video today, so I felt in honor of that. Let's go ahead and put together a remake for that song. So let's get straight to it. A couple weeks back, you might have remembered I did a tutorial on the piano sound, so we're going to use that one in this tutorial. But before we do that, let's go ahead and change the tempo to 140 beats per minute. And we will bring in that channel strip setting. If you save those channel strips from my tutorials, uh, we're going to go ahead and bring that in. Where is it here? Right here, offset Cardi B clout. If you want to see how this piano was put together, go ahead and click the link in the top right hand corner. I'll place a card there so you can uh, go ahead and watch it. But it's essentially a piano mixed in with some chorus, an echo, uh, some reverb, and then some detuning on the uh, or warping, if you will, on the actual sound using Isotopes free plugin called Vinyl. So let's go ahead and draw in this pattern. It is a two bar pattern, which is pretty much the pattern for the entire track. And uh, let's go ahead and draw this in. Changes over to a pencil tool. Let's push that a little bit closer together. That's better. All right, and then we're gonna go ahead and just uh, put in one over here. Same notes, essentially. And it's going to go down a little bit, so we can just go ahead and copy that over and bring that down. All right, so there's our sound right over there. Maybe for our EQ on the top end, I might pull this back a little bit. Maybe I'll cut a little bit more of the, the high end. I'll bring back some in. All right, so there's essentially the main pattern for the entire record. Next, let's go and create a new softer instrument track. And we are going to go bring in Logic's EXS24 sampler instrument. And we will bring in that clout drum kit, make it nice and loud. And let's go ahead and draw in our first pattern. And uh, let's start off with our hi-hats. So we're going to change this to a brush tool. And uh, let's change this to an eighth note. And I believe our hats was on C4. Let's repeat that. And we get something like this. Maybe I'll soften up that hi-hat a little bit. Just pulling up the attack there. And let's go ahead and draw in our quick stutters. We'll go to our brush tool, bring in a 30 second note. And this second note right here gets four notes in there or 30 second notes in that quick hit over there and then this is going to drop let's go to this and then this whole last pattern here sort of drops down the scale so let's go ahead and draw that in right now and get something like that Push this a little bit to the left as it's heard in the track. And I'm going to cut out some of the low end. All 
All right, that sounds good like that. Next, I'm going to duplicate this track. I'm going to take out our EQ. Bypass, I'll take it out altogether. Uh, let's bring our volume back up, reset our pan, and let's go ahead and draw in our snare sound. So for our snare, let's go ahead and uh, I think I put it up here. Bring in a pencil. Put that in. I'll leave that nice and loud, but I will bring in some reverb on this guy. That's yeah, a little bit too much. Bring that down a little bit more. All right, next let's go ahead and uh, duplicate this track. And uh, let's draw in that shaker sound. It's just a one hit over here. Oh. And it's right over here. Uh, where was my sound though? Maybe I'll pitch this down a little bit. Sounds a little high. That's a little better. There we go. All right, let's just lower that a bit in the mix. All right, next let's go ahead and duplicate this track. And uh, we're gonna take out this reverb, not move it, take it out. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and draw in our 808s. Now our 808s has two patterns in this track. Uh, it's a fairly simple pattern, both patterns. You'll see in a moment. Let's go ahead and do the first one that is played out at the beginning of the record. All right, so we're gonna go to a nice low octave here. And we're gonna go ahead and draw it in over here. What I'm gonna do here is turn on mono so our 808s won't overlap. track right there next all we got to do is an arrangement and we're gonna to put together a quick arrangement right over here so I'm gonna take this and I'm just gonna duplicate it five times and the second 808 pattern comes in at bar five and these two last hits come out so I'm just gonna go ahead and do that and that's it for the change up in the 808 <laughs> Pianos come in over here just by itself. And then over here, I'm going to grab in our 808s here, or the pattern with the two hits at the end. And on the third beat, it has this little quick hit here. Now let's go ahead and copy over the pianos. And we're going to copy over this section once again. And we're, where the snare comes in, we're going to cut out. And it gets something like this. And then we get this, whoop, and we get this again. And then we pretty much repeat this section. But for the tutorial's sake, I'm just going to make it four bars. Uh, let's do this 808 pattern. And then we'll end off with this pattern. And then we'll just end off with the piano for about four bars. And that's pretty much the song right there. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. Listen to the remake we just put together. Offsets featuring Cardi B, Cloud. Let's go. Thank you. 
right so right there is the remake to offsets track featuring cardi b clout for you logic users out there i am going to go ahead and save this entire session for you guys place that as a downloadable link in the description box below this video for you non logic users out there got your back as well i'm going to go and export all the mini stems i'll include all the mid, uh, loops audio loops as well and of course include the drum kit and the sounds that we used in this tutorial you can find that entire play pack in the description box below this video if you do have any questions on this or just want to chat let's go ahead and talk in the comment section below and if you did like this video remember thumbs up share it and if you are a new time in music mogul remember to hit that subscribe button for more good videos like this one i'll talk to y'all soon later peace